Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Call Me Beach and I am back with another NBA 2K21 no money spent episode for you guys, man. So today is number two of no money spent. And guys, I'm actually really excited to be bringing this content. I'm just not going to lie to you. This has been, I really am glad that I decided to go ahead and make up a change. I'm still, you know, managing my main account and making sure that it is okay with things I want. But this is where I'm spending a lot of my time in and it has been fun and it has been great. And I'm happy that I'm able to make a lot more content here for you also. No money spent episode two today, guys, here. We got a few things to talk about and kind of update you with what's going on with the team. But before we go ahead and get into that, make sure you go ahead and drop a like on the video. And if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notification. That way you do not ever miss a new video when we do drop it. If you're already subscribed and everything like that, man, I appreciate you all. You are the greatest. You all are supportive. I love it. I love you guys. I appreciate it, man. But enough of that. Let, let's go ahead and get right into it, guys. So as we know, we are on this no money spent ground. We have a lot of things to go through. Um, in the last episode, we talked about my team limited. I will be going for Elgin Baylor and we did get our first rank. So we're almost there now on our way to Vince Carter. We are level 26, not in any crazy rush or race as they have made it. But guys, this XP is just the XP is easy, but at times you will need some MT to get there. As you can see, we have 46,000. So we've been pretty good, guys. Now, where is that MT coming from, guys? Well, guys. I have been grinding triple threat online and when I mean grinding triple threat online I'm not gonna lie to you I have probably played I want to say probably 70 games of triple threat online I've been through this board so many times guys so the tokens as you can see I have 229 tokens the tokens have been racking up I've been getting packs and packs and packs and packs and guys I have been grinding this mode this is the key to really my no money spent any type of success right now um it is this mode man i've been grinding this like crazy if you have any thoughts about what you should do to make mt it's this mode right here okay now i am going to show you all something i haven't done it myself but i've seen proof of it shout out to my guy kurt and shout out to my guy jay who actually did bring this to my attention about not these packs okay guys do not touch these packs if you're on a no money spend account unless you're just rich but these packs right here okay these packs um have a chance to get the new series players okay as we know now i'm not sure if this is purely from the season because you need xp from from it or if it is in my team limited i'm not gonna buy one right now i'm gonna just be completely honest with you guys but they will get you or you should get some of these players now if you do luck up and let me see if i have I don't have anybody but let's say you luck up and get some of these silvers as you can see guys this has no bid so you can easily put this card up for probably like two or three k and you get um mt off of this like i'm just trying to take a look and kind of show you guys what i'm talking about like as you see if you pull a silver carson edwards that's four thousand mt okay um you know what just for the sake of the video i'm gonna pull one pack i'm just gonna pull one i'm just gonna see what happens so let me just go ahead and pull one pack here and let's just see what happens so um as we pull this pack you see we flip all right here i don't get i get some bronzes okay um so let's just check that bronze so our pack was 3750 um as we go into the series three let's find that bronze that we just got was it here okay so 3750 so guys if i look right here this guy i mean you could probably get two to three k mt off of this guy so i'm actually just gonna send him to the auction house i'm gonna do it right now but two to three thousand and then you have to remember we did get a shoe in there we got some other things so pretty much we're probably gonna break even on that pack okay um like i said i'm just gonna put them up for three thousand mt um and then by the time i sell the rest of that stuff we could probably break even now if you look at the other silvers that we're talking about um if you get 5k you've already made your money back plus some profit and then you sell the rest of the stuff in the pack okay so 
just think about that guys as we're kind of going through here make sure to watch the trend of the series three players because you do need them for xp so little guys they may stay a little more expensive throughout the season so just that could be a way to make some mt guys i'm not going to spend a crap ton on that but just to throw that out there now let's actually go ahead and see as you can see my auction house was a little full you know you're seeing some things now these are just coming out of packs guys like i said i have been grinding that mode like crazy did get a diamond contract from i believe it was limited so i have some things to sell here now lamello ball is being so guys if you don't know i went together and put like together a little five man okay um i used some mt remember at season or episode one we're up at 100k now i did go ahead and use some mt to build out a five man and lamello was one of my guys however he was selling me in tto so as much as i love lamello he has to go now i did pick up this lamello and he did actually come with hall of fame showtime which he doesn't usually come with so i put him up earlier he didn't sell i'm going to be putting him back up and then i'm going to be selling the rest of the stuff because as you know we're no money spent so we are on the terms of making mt so to go into it guys now i am going to show you what i have put together here as a team and i built it out guys because we did get our first dark matter our first dark matter guys in two days of having this account open we did get our first dark matter so taking a look here guys this is kind of what the team or so looks like okay now mr bailey how guys 70 games at least around 70 and we finally did get bailey how and if you don't know about Bailey Howe, guys, you guys are missing out, okay? I'm going to just kind of scroll through the stats here, guys. This card is ridiculous, okay? Like, very, very ridiculous. You see that he has 44 Hall of Fame badges and 21 Go badges, and the card is completely free now. If you need somebody to re relate this card to, Tracy McGrady, DeMar DeRozan, okay? He literally has, like, I think exactly their signatures, down to the jump shot and everything is a free t-mac or derozan what can we what can we argue with okay guys as you can see the rest of the team guys this is isn't really that set in stone it's just kind of my best cards now i did pick up juan carlos navarro if you know anything about being a park player or a pro am player which i originate from you know why i have this card he's been carrying me through triple threat online like i'll show you right now in triple threat online this is literally this is literally the team I run with. So I do have Galaxy Open Chris Weber as well, which you'll see on the team. Juan Carlos and then Precious Achua. Uh, this card is its a ridiculous amethyst, guys. If, if you don't know about him, check him out. Like, I don't know why he's so good, but he's amazing, all right? Um, but coming back over to the team, as you can see, we do have Juan Carlos Navarro, Trevor Ariza, who's amazing. The new bailey how guys precious is in here um we may make a few changes to the team but we do have poku um and then we have miles turner down here we did get pink diamond roco um chris weber was also one of our buys who i really just needed guys this card is really good um as a three and d guy okay like i'm gonna be honest with you he's not the facilitator or anything like that um but he does like have hall of fame diamond and stuff so he does come in pretty much handy and you know he can speed glitch and everything obviously he has hall of fame dimer so he actually he provides great value for me so i did pick him up for about 55k juan carlos was about 30k um trevor reza was 4k poku was maybe eight or so and roko was about seven so we didn't spend too much mt guys but with all of that being said and all of these packs i do have a lot of things to sell like if you come and look in my collection like i have a lot of things to sell um which i will be doing because we definitely need to make sure that we keep our mt count up as you can see i have shoes like crazy because i just been having packs guys so a lot of things to go ahead and kind of get around to but guys like i said we have our first dark matter guys and I, it came so early within two days of the account and I, it's just amazing how this team really just looks like this already okay like even just from the first time that you saw the team the fact that we look like this is is actually pretty amazing um but yeah guys so we still have some more grinding to do but we do have our first dark matter mr bailey how um grind for this card if you can guys i know it kind of sucks with you know he may not show up a lot but i was determined to get him okay so like next my next goal of action is what i think i think we're gonna come in here and try our luck with larry keenan hopefully he comes out of the ball at some point in time 
I have been grinding a little bit for him, but it's it's the vault. I mean, what do you want me to say? It's the vault, guys. Um, so we'll we'll see what it is, and then eventually, of course, we're going to be getting Elgin, and then um, at some point in time, we will have Vince Carter, guys. So no money spent. Part two, you see the team. Um, I wish I could gift this to one of you all watching this, but I can't. <laughs> That's just me showing off a little bit, guys. I'm very happy about this card, but. Um, yeah, that pretty much wraps up this episode here. Um, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you would like to see more gameplays during the No Money Spin series, okay? Like, I'm going to just keep it real with you. Um, when I watch other videos, I kind of skip gameplay at this point. Like, I don't know. It's just, it doesn't interest me. So I don't put it in mind. I just kind of talk about the team, kind of give you tips, things that I'm thinking about with my team, kind of moves that I'm making. But if you all would like to see gameplay, let me know that down in the comments. And we will go ahead and we'll start working something out with gameplay. But that is really all the content that I have for you all, man. Like I said, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Um, remember to go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, guys, I appreciate you all. But we out.